Hey guys, thanks for joining me. This is Angie at Chicken Scratch. This is the second card for our Awesome Otters card class. So this is the first card and this is our second one. And you'll see the third soon. Okay, so here's our supplies. This time we're using Pool Party on the original one or the first one we used uh, Misty Moonlight with Just Jade. Okay, so we're gonna use um, our Simply Scored scoring tool to score this at four and a quarter. I'm gonna fold and then burnish with my bone folder. Okay, so now we're gonna take this layer here and add it to the inside of our card. So I'm just using liquid glue Now for this layer here, we're gonna add our designer series paper squares or rectangles. So this one's gonna go here, and this one's gonna go here, this one here, and this one here. Okay, so let's move this out of the way. Again, I'm gonna use liquid glue. Now for the details about the card class, I do have all the details over on my website. And I will also recap those on the third video, okay? I guess I could talk about it while I'm gluing this down. So to get the supplies to make um, all three cards, um, if you place a minimum $40 order using my special host code, you can get the kit for free. If you place a $50 order, you can get a full pack of the blue, what are these called? Adhesive backed gems along with your um, supplies to make the cards. And if you're not interested, um, that's okay. I just have had lots of people ask me about card kits, so I decided to give it a try. I'm going to do three of them this first quarter of the year, and uh, we'll see how it goes. But yeah, I've just had lots of people ask me, and I'm like, okay, you know what? I'm going to start offering a card class, because I know people really like making cards and mailing cards. Okay, so there's that part. Now, let's go ahead and stamp our images. This is Awesome Otters. We got the greeting from um, Sweet as a Peach Photopolymer stamp set. If you don't have that stamp set, that's okay. Use whatever greeting you want that will fit on a half inch strip. So this is just half inch by two and a half, okay? So here's my images. I'm gonna slide all this out of the way. I'm using Memento ink. Go ahead and get the greeting done first. Okay, and then now our otter. He's a little high, but that's okay because the greeting's going right under him. So we're using the layering circles dies and the hippo and friends dies, but these pieces will be cut out for you, okay? We're gonna start with flirty flamingo. So we're using two sets of blends, Flirty Flamingo and Crumb Cake. Okay, and I'm just gonna go around the line of the otter. This is the dark crumb cake. And now we're gonna take the light. I need to use my brush tip. My bullet point one is starting to get dry, so I'm about to have to order a new set.
So you'll have to let me know, did you order the otter set? Do you like it? I love it so much. Okay, I'm gonna take the Wink of Stella and just color in the white part. Give it a little shimmer. And then this is gonna get popped up on this section. So I'm using my regular Stampin' Dimensionals. And I'm just gonna put them on there so that I don't have to turn this upside down and get the Wink of Stella on my paper here. And then our greeting, we're gonna take our scissors and just angle cut this a little bit. So let's go ahead and add this layer to our card front. So all the measurements will be provided in the class PDF, similar to the inspiration sheet, but just a little bit different. Okay, that's gonna go in the center also with liquid glue. Hold that for a second. We're gonna pop the greeting up also with a dimensional. And then we just have our ribbon and embellishments. So I've got 10 and a half inches of the ribbon. We'll add that first and then we'll add our embellishments. Gonna trim the end. And that's gonna go right there and trim it just a little bit more. We're gonna add it with a glue dot. Now when you're mailing this card, if you want to mail it, just put a piece of uh, heavy card stock on top and kind of smush it, and you should you should be able to get away with that, okay? So now we're gonna add our embellishments. This time we're using the lighter color. On our first card, we use the darker color. Whoops. Okay, so that wraps up card uh, number two, and then this is card one. You'll see the third one soon. Don't forget to check out all the details over on my blog about how to get this card kit for free uh, with placing an order. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks so much. Bye.